Welcome, rare gems. Some people are drawn to you like a magnet. They can't explain why, but there's something about your presence that makes them want to be near you. Yet despite all this attention, you've come to realize that not everyone deserves to stay in your orbit. It's not arrogance. It's clarity. You've seen through enough facades to know that most people are more interested in the idea of you than in who you really are. You stand out because you don't fit into the usual molds. You're not here to meet expectations or make anyone comfortable. In fact, the very things that make people chase you are the same reasons they'll never truly get you. You move through life on your own terms, and that's unsettling to those who are used to easy answers and simple personalities. They may want you, but they don't really know how to handle you, and that's why you're rare. You're not difficult to figure out because you're hiding something. You're rare because you're unapologetically yourself, in a world that prefers you to fit in. And when people realize they can't put you in a box, they're either fascinated or frustrated. Either way, you remain exactly as you are, free. Let's get started, Rare Gems. I recommend watching the complete video for a better understanding, and I'd be interested in hearing your thoughts in the comments section. Number 1. They want to own you, but they can't even understand you. People are naturally drawn to what they can't fully grasp, and you're no exception. There's something about the way you carry yourself that leaves people wanting more, but the more they try to figure you out, the more frustrated they become. They think they can wrap you up in a neat little package, but Every time they think they've got you pinned down, you surprise them by moving in a completely different direction. What they fail to realize is that you're not something to be owned or controlled. While others live their lives trying to meet expectations, you're driven by your own inner compass. You don't bend to fit into anyone's mold, and that confuses people who are used to putting others into boxes. They want to define you, to make sense of you, but you operate on a wavelength they can't tune into. The more they push, the more lost they become, caught up in their need to control something that refuses to be controlled. And while they spin in circles, you remain untouched, moving through life with a freedom they'll never understand. You don't need their approval or validation, and that's exactly what makes you so rare. Number two, they want your confidence, but they don't want your struggles. People see your confidence and assume it came naturally. They look at the way you carry yourself, calm, self-assured, unshaken, and they envy it. They want to have that same sense of certainty, that same unshakable composure. But what they don't see is the path you walked to get there. They want the confidence, but they would never choose the struggles that built it. What people miss is that your resilience was born from real hardship, not from luck or talent. You didn't just wake up one day and decide to be strong. You were forged by moments of pain, loneliness, and challenges that most would crumble under. You faced situations that forced you to confront your limits, and instead of breaking, you found ways to push through. You've had to deal with silence when there were no easy answers, and you had to rely on yourself when no one else was there. They admire your strength, but they'd never want to live through what you did to earn it. They only see the result the polished exterior, the calm in the storm. But they don't see the years of self-doubt, the nights of solitude, the countless setbacks. The truth is, your confidence didn't come for free. It was the reward for surviving what most people will never understand. And while they may want to walk in your shoes, they'd never choose the rocky path you took to get here. Number three, you're a mirror and it terrifies them. When people spend time around you, they often feel a discomfort they can't quite put into words. It's not because you're confrontational or judgmental, but because your very presence acts like a mirror. You reflect back to them their own insecurities without even trying. Your self-sufficiency, the way you move through life without seeking approval, shows them exactly how much they rely on the validation of others. It's a stark contrast that forces them to see where they fall short, and that can be unsettling. They're used to measuring themselves against others, but with you, the rules change. You don't play the game of seeking acknowledgement or bending to fit into someone else's expectations. Instead, you stand firm in who you are, and that confidence is a silent reminder of everything they're still grappling with inside. It's not that you're trying to make them feel insecure. 
but the gap between your clarity and their uncertainty becomes glaringly obvious when you're around. For many, this reflection is painful. They realize how much they depend on the approval of others to feel whole. While you've mastered the art of being content within yourself, it's not an easy thing to face, and some will resent you for it. But the truth is, it's not you that terrifies them. It's the version of themselves they see in your presence. They want what you have, but they're not ready to face the uncomfortable truths it reveals about their own lives. Thank you, Rare Gems, for being a valued subscriber. Your continued support is incredibly important to us and inspires us to keep producing meaningful content. We truly appreciate your engagement and support. Number 4. You leave before you're asked to stay. You've never been one to stick around waiting for someone to ask you to stay. While most people cling to the idea of being needed, you're already gone before anyone even realizes it. You don't wait for validation or an invitation to belong in someone's life. You're not looking for approval or a sense of worth through someone else. Your emotional independence sets you apart, and it's something most can't comprehend until you're no longer there. People often assume they have more time with you. They think you'll stick around like everyone else, hoping for a deeper connection, waiting for that moment when they'll be truly valued. But you don't linger where you aren't valued from the start. If someone doesn't recognize your worth early on, you're out. There's no dramatic exit, no need for explanations. You simply move on, leaving a quiet absence that people don't fully understand until it's too late. This independence is a powerful filter. It separates those who matter from those who were just passing by. The ones who can keep up, who see your value from the beginning, are the ones who get to stay. The rest, well, they're left realizing what they missed after you're long gone. You don't chase, you don't wait, and that's what makes your presence rare and unforgettable. By the time they understand what they've lost, you're already on to the next chapter, unbothered and moving forward. Number 5. Your silence speaks louder than their noise. In a world that thrives on noise and constant chatter, your silence is a powerful statement. While everyone around you gets caught up in drama and endless distractions, you stand apart, embodying a calm that feels almost palpable. People often feel the need to fill every moment with words, seeking validation or attention, but your quiet presence speaks volumes, creating a stark contrast that both unnerves and captivates those around you. When you choose to remain silent, it draws attention. Others can't help but notice how you navigate chaos with grace. They're accustomed to the loud, boisterous energy of their surroundings, where the frantic pace of life often drowns out clarity and focus. Your calmness becomes a refuge, a breath of fresh air in an environment filled with superficial chatter. While they scramble for the spotlight, you observe, taking in everything without feeling the need to interject. Your silence forces people to confront their own insecurities and chaos. It highlights their dependence on noise to feel relevant or important. They may feel threatened by your composure, realizing that while they chase after attention, you possess a strength that comes from within. This unnerving quality makes them curious about you. They want to know the secret behind your calm. In your stillness, you hold a magnetic power that compels others to engage with you, not just to fill the void, but to uncover the depths that lie beneath your silence. Number 6. You're hard to love because you're impossible to control. You embody a fierce sense of independence that sets you apart, making you difficult to love in the traditional sense. In a world where many people seek to control their relationships, you refuse to play by those rules. For you, love isn't about submission or compromise. It's about authenticity and mutual respect. Those who attempt to dominate or tame you quickly discover the futility of their efforts. You have an unyielding spirit, and your loyalty lies solely with your own values and standards. This is where the frustration begins for others. They may see your self-sufficiency as a challenge, mistaking your independence for aloofness. Their attempts to mold you into something you're not only lead to disappointment. You are not a puzzle to be solved or a project to be completed. Instead, you're a dynamic individual with your own desires and principles, and anyone who tries to control you will find themselves battling against a force far more powerful than they anticipated. 
Your relationships thrive on honesty and equality, not manipulation or power struggles. You seek connections that uplift and inspire, not ones that seek to bind you in chains of expectation. This approach can be intimidating for those accustomed to conventional dynamics. They may long for your affection, but their inability to accept your freedom makes true intimacy impossible. In the end, it's this very independence that makes you so appealing to the right people, those who recognize that real love is about embracing each other's freedom, not trying to cage it. Number 7. Your depth intimidates the shallow. You possess a profound depth that many find intimidating. In a world where most people are content to float in shallow waters, your ability to dive deep into meaningful conversations and connections sets you apart. While others chase the superficial, small talk about the weather or gossip that lacks real substance, you seek genuine engagement. This commitment to depth can be unsettling for those who thrive on the surface, as they often feel exposed when confronted with your intensity. When you enter a room, your presence is palpable. You draw people in with your authenticity and the complexity of your thoughts. But for those who are unaccustomed to this kind of engagement, your depth can feel overwhelming. They may feel a sense of vulnerability, grappling with their own insecurities as they realize they can't keep up. Their attempts to engage in trivial banter fall flat in your company, leaving them feeling inadequate. They may even resort to shallow behavior, trying to mask their discomfort with humor or deflection, but this only highlights the contrast between you and them. As a result, the shallow connections that might once have seemed appealing quickly dissipate. You don't entertain relationships that lack substance, and those who aren't ready to explore the depths of human experience tend to drift away. This natural filtering process leaves you surrounded by the rarest individuals. Those who not only appreciate your depth, but are eager to dive into the complexities of life with you. In this way, your depth becomes both a shield and a beacon, guiding you toward connections that truly matter while leaving behind the noise of the shallow. Number 8. Your value isn't negotiable, and that's uncommon. In a society where many people trade their values for acceptance, you stand firm in your worth. Your value isn't up for negotiation, it's a fixed part of who you are. While others may bend or alter their beliefs to fit in or gain approval, you remain unwavering in your principles. This authenticity is both refreshing and rare, setting you apart from the crowd. You understand that self-respect and boundaries are essential, and you're unafraid to enforce them. If a situation or a person doesn't recognize your value, you don't hesitate to walk away. This confidence can be shocking to those who are used to playing games or compromising their identities for the sake of connection. They may crave your presence, drawn to your strength and clarity, but when faced with the reality that you won't lower your standards, many are left feeling frustrated and unworthy. Your refusal to compromise creates a magnetic aura around you. People often admire your self-assurance from a distance, wanting to engage with you but hesitant to confront the reality that you demand respect. You challenge the status quo, and in doing so, you inspire others to reconsider their own worth. This unyielding stance leaves many yearning for what they can't have. They recognize that you're not just another person to pass through their lives. You are a reminder that true value is intrinsic and not dependent on the opinions of others. In a world where conformity often reigns, your unwavering self-worth makes you a rare and coveted treasure, leaving many to admire you from afar, wishing they had the courage to stand firm in their own value as you do. Number 9. They want to box you in, but you have no label. People often feel the need to categorize others, creating neat little boxes to help them understand who someone is. This desire for labeling comes from a place of comfort, it's easier to relate to someone when you can quickly identify their role or identity, but you refuse to be confined by these labels. You exist in a realm of your own, where conventional definitions don't apply. This lack of a label can be unsettling for those around you, as they're faced with someone who challenges their assumptions. Your refusal to fit into societal expectations creates a ripple effect. When people encounter you, they're not just meeting an individual. They're confronted with a force that forces them to reconsider their own beliefs and biases. 
You might be seen as a free spirit, an independent thinker, or even a rebel, but the truth is that you're simply authentic. You don't need a label to validate your existence. Your actions and thoughts speak volumes. This authenticity can be intimidating because it requires others to step out of their comfort zones. In a world obsessed with conformity, your ability to live without a label is both liberating and revolutionary. It challenges the status quo and forces people to question their need for definitions. You're a reminder that human experience is complex and multifaceted, and that real depth can't be captured in a single word or category. Your presence invites others to embrace their own individuality, making you a rare and powerful force in a world that often craves simplicity. Number 10. People want access to you because you make them question their own mediocrity. People are drawn to you because you unsettle them in ways they can't quite explain. It's not just your confidence or uniqueness, they sense something deeper. Being around you forces them to confront parts of themselves they'd rather ignore. You don't have to say much. Your presence alone holds up a mirror to their choices, making them question just how much they've settled for in life. Most people go through the motions, comfortable with mediocrity, never pushing beyond what's expected. But when they're around you, they can't help but feel exposed. You live on a different level, driven by ambition and a thirst for more. You don't follow the easy path, and your refusal to settle makes them uncomfortable with their own complacency. They want access to you because, deep down, they hope some of what you have will rub off on them. They crave the energy you bring, hoping it will shake them out of their routine. But what they don't realize is that keeping up with you takes more than just being around. It requires them to level up in ways they may not be ready for. That's where the struggle comes in. They want what you have, but they're not prepared to put in the work or face the hard truths you've already embraced. Being near you makes them question their own lack of ambition, and for many that's both inspiring and terrifying at the same time. Number 11. You don't just break expectations, you redefine them. You have a unique ability to not just break expectations, but to completely redefine them. While many people operate within predefined boundaries, doing what's expected or conforming to societal norms, you move through life with a fluidity that keeps everyone guessing. When people think they've figured you out, you're already evolving into something new, leaving their preconceived notions in the dust. This constant transformation can be both mesmerizing and disconcerting to those around you. Your presence challenges the status quo. When you step into a room, you don't just fill a role, you create a new standard. People might come in with ideas about who you should be based on past experiences or stereotypes, but you have no interest in being boxed in. Your multifaceted nature means that what they thought they wanted, an easy-to-read, predictable version of you, quickly becomes irrelevant. By the time they adjust to one iteration, you've already shifted, presenting them with a fresh perspective that forces them to reconsider their expectations entirely. This dynamic can create a sense of intrigue and excitement, drawing people to you in ways they don't quite understand. Yet, it can also intimidate those who prefer familiarity. For them, you are a puzzle that defies easy solutions. Your evolution isn't just about personal growth. It's a challenge to others to expand their own understanding of potential. In a world that often demands conformity, your ability to redefine expectations stands as a powerful testament to your authenticity. You're not just living life, you're reshaping it, inspiring others to think beyond their limitations and embrace the possibility of transformation. In a world filled with noise and superficial connections, you stand out as a Sigma female, an embodiment of authenticity and depth that many admire but few can truly understand. Your unique qualities draw people in, making them crave your presence, yet your unwillingness to compromise your values or settle for anything less than genuine connection sets you apart. You're not just another face in the crowd. You are a force that challenges norms and expectations. While others may seek to control or define you, they often find themselves frustrated and confused. Your emotional independence and fierce self-worth create a magnetic aura that only the right people can appreciate. 
You leave situations that don't honor your value, making you a rarity in a world that often compromises authenticity for acceptance. Those who don't align with your standards fade away, leaving behind only those who are ready to engage with the real you. Ultimately, your rarity lies not just in your strength and resilience, but in your ability to inspire others to confront their own mediocrity. You redefine what it means to be truly connected, reminding those around you that self-worth and authenticity should never be negotiable. In a society filled with conformists, you shine as a beacon of hope for anyone brave enough to embrace their own uniqueness. You may be a rarity, but it's precisely that which makes you invaluable to those fortunate enough to be in your orbit. Thank you, Rare Gems, for tuning in. Stay vigilant as always. See you in our next video. God bless you.